I just uh, I just saw him <laughs> coming back after a bad crash, and uh, and uh, I just asked how he felt and if he knew who he was, <laughs> and <laughs> because he, he looked really bad. And is it true you gave him a little help the last game? I just pushed him a little bit. Uh, I think he, of course, he had a hard time on the bike, and uh, and uh, with the conditions like this, uh, I think he should be in the hospital. But uh, I mean, he he. Uh, He's fighting hard and wants to be on the bike, so really impressive. Impressive, even for the world champion Tor Hushoft. The story of the day before, Laurens ten Dam, the brave Dutchman, finished the stage. Ja, het, uh, op zich, wat ik zeg, ik had geluk met de rit. Het was uh, 190 kilometer, dat was een lange rit. Alleen uh, is waren na twee kilometer al weg, dus uh, ik hoefde niet eerst een uur uh, onder mijn stuur te kruipen om te kunnen volgen. En uh, nou, op, het laatste, uh, ja, op het laatste ging het heel goed, vooral uh, complimenten. Compliment aan Nicky, want die heeft heel hard gereden. Ik denk dat daar uh, vandaag de meeste aandacht naar uit uh, kan gaan, naar Nicky. Aurens says he was lucky with this stage, long, but the early break made it easier to follow. And thanks countryman Nicky Terpstra for riding as hard as he did in the breakaway. Ten dan made it, as did Christian Nierman, who summarizes the stage. Uh, it wasn't a nice stage at all. Uh, it was very windy, very uh, dangerous, uh, a lot of people on the road and... Uh, yeah, we, we rode a pretty hard tempo all day, especially because of the the tailwind. <laughs> so uh, everybody's happy we have a rest day now, I guess. So that uh, when in the front of the stage, when everybody was getting nervous because of the winds, that was... Uh, yeah, it was, uh, it's, it's always like this because uh, nobody wants to lose time, especially not the guys of the classification. And uh, it didn't really go in the crosswind, but, but it was very nervous all day. And uh, that's uh, a very hard stage like this. Okay, tomorrow rest day and then the Alps, huh? Yeah, we're looking forward to, to the rest day at first and then uh, to some nice alpine stages.